when we initially started writing Chasing Shadows, that it yeah. was the intro, the keyboard, yeah. it was played on like a guitar. It was because yeah. I was uh, I wanted to do something uh, like classic rock, like da na 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 na. But and then, and then we just had the total wrong vibe, so we would put it on the keyboard instead. Um, but I guess it's uh, this is probably one of the more like metal songs we ever written. Yeah. In a way. Yeah. <laughs> Let's get into it and see yeah. uh, what the demo sounds like. Really close to the original. Well, it was one of the last ones we wrote. Yeah. I fear the end is just beginning. Yeah. A little bit more effect here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's really the same ones. The strings also here. Yes. Let's see what goes on here. This is exactly what we're using the finished production. Yeah. That goes for this, yeah. all the tracks. I really like this, these little ones here. No? Oh no. It's on the strings. It's on the strings, yeah, sorry. And same goes here, we used a plug in here and recorded the real ones in the studio. Did you do them finger plucked? Yeah. So. Pretty cinematic, right? Oh, this was so low. Yeah. It's in drop E, like one up and down. Because it was written at first in another key. But then we had to lower it, we were like, yeah, it doesn't really feel good to sing. Yeah. And uh, I was a bit scared because I thought that it's never gonna work out to, to okay. put it in like E. Oh, yeah, yeah. But <laughs> because it's so, so low. We play yeah. six string. I mean, we play yeah. six string, so I mean. But it worked out, and yeah. it sounds great in the studio. And this is what's going on in the atmosphere. Yeah, the yeah. It's super verse. moody. Really moody. On the process local. You recorded these, like, yeah. little there's ornaments. A, there's like. a lot of vocals uh, recorded and processed as uh, soundscape, uh, ambiance in the tracks, and even this little reverse s snare or something you would think, a uh, mm. reverse symbol is actually just me blowing. <laughs> <Like, laughs> and then, the, yeah, and reversing and then processing it by the soundscape. It sounds great. Oh man, this is like total. Now it's gone. And obviously. MIDI drums yeah. on the recording or the, the, the demo. Yeah. But everything else is the same. Mm. It's a pretty big arrangement, like everything here. It's like, that's what we want, just big, wide soundscape. Yeah. But I can see here that we also developed like the string arrangement in the studio. Because mm -hmm. here is basically nothing else than just a MIDI string. Yeah. So I think I recorded all of that, but for real. Yeah. Some parts you do record here on violin, but more, mostly like lead parts. I mean, for Turn the Light On, I actually recorded all the violins uh, here. In the uh, demo, yeah. But for Henry yeah. Hiding, everything was recorded with Henry. Yeah. Um, but this. Chorus actually doesn't have much atmosphere um, in the background. It's mm -hmm. just it's mainly the violins that fill out that extra mm -hmm. void. This is the only thing that's laying there in the chorus. Yeah, I think it's more um, in the, the next part. But we wanted to open it for for vocals basically to be like that very mm. direct main vocal stuff. <laughs> This part is like guitar and bass, yeah. drums, so like, like we're rocking still. Little add on guitar, I just put it in to be like yeah. push the parts. Groovy stuff to be like to create that yeah. you know, development. 
But yeah, we do this Atmos guitar sometimes also. Yeah, I think this one is in the first verse as well. Yeah, I think so. And there's a little extra beat on the drums, like over the drum parts. So. Yeah, you should have to look here. Ah, actually. And this is something we used in the final recording as well. Yeah. It's the little extra texture. Yeah. So with the original track of drums, I think it works really well. So it's pretty scaled down, but there's small things happening in the background just oh. to keep it a little bit interesting. This is a, uh, this is you playing. Yeah. yeah. really uh, interesting in a way because I think the, it matches the song really well but yeah. it's a bit unexpected kind of melody actually. Yeah, we well, don't usually have so many solos in the house, but uh, yeah. this is just a quick take, yeah. like a one take. I'm getting a bit like yeah. East Oriental vibe from that, it's really yeah. cool. Yeah, there's a lot of like glissando and just moving uh, along the string with one finger to create that other uh, sound. And this part, uh, which is process vocals, is actually the one we're using in the final recording. Uh, there's like additional newly recorded yeah. vocals with some falsetto, but this here exactly was used to. Um, and the final version as well. This year. Real metallic, yeah, real metallic. Right. To create that nasty and, build up, really. And this here is also like process vocals um, used for atmosphere in the background. <laughs> We do like live intros and stuff like that. Um, we usually yeah. work a lot with these things here to create atmosphere, basically. Yeah, and this is what else is going on in the background. Before we playing the whole breakdown, I remember like because we had written it almost finished, and then it was just the, the last part yeah. which we talked about. I, I remember that Alex was here and Peter was here, and yeah. we spoke about okay, how should we just finish the song? Um, because this was pretty pretty late in the writing process, and I was we talked about maybe we should just fucking just make a breakdown, and I was like, oh, maybe not, maybe we shouldn't do it. And then we talked about it, and I remember I went in here and you, you were doing something in the kitchen I was like, okay, I'm, I'm just going to work on it for a while and then, yeah, then when I, just, I remember you just, I turned it up and played it for you guys and you were like, yeah, that's exactly, exactly where we're going. Yeah, it, it needed this. <laughs> it's so, it's so nasty. <laughs> So this is one of my favorite atmospheric, atmospheric parts, um, like also process vocals over the breakdown, and it gives such a nice... I think this is, this is from the intro of the song, like I 
fear the end has just begun. Uh -huh. um, just processed. Um, it's really cool. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The tremble over here in the yeah. background. And this is also re recorded in the studio, mm. actually. Could be the heaviest part we ever wrote, I yes. guess, in a way.